What's up fellow content creators and streamers? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to turn your C920 from a piece of junk into an actual DSR lookalike webcam. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. And before anything, what you're going to want to do is look up NVIDIA Broadcast. It's going to take you to this website and then you're just going to download it right here. Once you download it, it's going to pop up with this little application and then you're going to want to go to the camera section. So the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure your camera source is set to your webcam. What you want to do next is click on this little settings icon and then this settings panel should pop up. The first thing I would recommend doing is going to camera control and turning off low light compensation. This will make your webcam not as blurry as it was before. The next thing you want to do is change your exposure. I would lower it more so then you really don't have that blurriness anymore but you are going to be darker but we'll fix that later in the video. What I like to do is focus on me more than the background so I'm just going to do a simple zoom in on me and try to get it right above my head. I have a little bit of extra space in case I move around. The next thing you want to do is go to video proc and you're going to want to increase your contrast to around one third 35 ish the next thing you want to do is really bump up your saturation you really want to get these colors because the camera ain't going to do it make sure you bump up that saturation i would recommend going all the way up to like around 150 for sharpness i would add a little bit don't add too much for gain this is where you get your camera back up to the regular brightness so you just want to add your gain until you're bright click apply on all of that so once you have all of that done what you're going to want to do next is just click ok on this and then where it says under effects background blur you're going to want to click enable on that and this will get the little blur behind you you can change the strength i would try to keep it on the much lower side because too much blurriness just looks bad and ugly once you have all that done you can just click the x out on this and as you can see it keeps running in the background so you don't have to worry about it the next thing you want to do is go into obs um if you haven't added the source already just add the source go to your properties you're going to want to change this to custom set your resolution to 1080 i set the fps to 60 try to get as much as i can out of the camera you can leave video format to any for color space i would set to 709 for color range i would set to full for the buffering just set the disabled and then that should be it so just click ok the next thing i like to do is go into webcam and click on the filters once you're under filters all you want to do is click on a plus on effects and then click on color correction for the gamma i would raise it up a little bit to make yourself brighter for contrast i would increase as well brightness don't touch this will just wash out your camera for saturation i would increase to around 0.3 and then don't touch anything else and then you'll just click close on this and now as you can see my camera looks way better than it did before and i hope this improves your stream qualities and recordings other than that i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you haven't already please be sure to drop a like and subscribe it takes two seconds to do and i'll be seeing you guys later peace out